From this class, we will be learning the first lesson, five digit numbers. Mathematics class for fifth standard. What is a number? A number is a combination of digits. Which is the smallest single digit number? Yes, it is one. Smallest one digit number is one. So that greatest one digit number will be nine. Now we will find the smallest two digit number. When we add one to the greatest single digit number, we get the smallest two digit number. Nine plus one equals to ten. Ten is the smallest two digit number. Now we got the smallest two digit number. Next we will go to greatest two digit number. Which is the greatest two digit number? Yes, it is 99. When we add 1 to the greatest 2 digit number, we get the smallest 3 digit number. 99 plus 1 equals to 100. 100 is the smallest 3 digit number. Now we got the smallest 3 digit number. Now we will go to greatest 3 digit number. Which is the greatest 3 digit number? Yes, it is 999. When we add 1 to the greatest 3 digit number, we get the smallest 4 digit number. 999 plus 1 equals to 1000. 1000 is the smallest 4 digit number. Now we got the smallest 4 digit number. Now we will go to greatest 4 digit number. Which is the greatest 4 digit number? Yes, it is 9999. When we add 1 to the greatest 4 digit number, we get the smallest 5 digit number. 9999 plus 1 equals to 10,000. 10,000 is the smallest 5 digit number. Children, now we will learn about Indian place value chart. The product of the digit and the value of its place is called the place value. Now we will learn up to 5 places. They are units, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. Now we will learn about periods. Units, tens, hundreds comes in units group. Thousand and ten thousand comes in thousands group. Now we will write 98431 in place value chart. First we will write the place values. First from the units group. Unit group has units, tens, hundreds. Next, thousands group. Thousands group has thousand, ten thousand. First, we will go from right to left. From the right, first digit is one. So, we will write one in units place. Now, the second number is three. The second place is tens. So, we will write three in tens place. Next, the third number is four. Third place is hundred. So, we should write 4 in hundreds place. Now, the fourth number is 8. Fourth place is 1000. So, we should write 8 in thousands place. Fifth number is 9. Which is the fifth place in the place value table? Yes. Fifth place is 10,000. So, we will write 9 in 10,000 place. We read it as 98,431. Now we will solve some problems in our textbook exercise 1.1. Insert commas at appropriate places in the following numbers and write in words. First read the digits 3, 2, 8, 9, 4. Now we will write these digits in place value table. First, we will go from right to left. From the right, first digit is 4. So, we will write 4 in units place. Now, the second number is 9. 
which is the second place in place value table from right side as tens place. So we should write 9 in tens place. Which is the third number? Yes, 8 is in the third number. Third place is hundreds. So we should write 8 in hundreds place. Now the fourth number is 2. Which is the fourth place in place value table? Yes, the fourth place is thousands place. So we should write 2 in thousands place. Next, the fifth number is 3. Which is the fifth place in place value table? From right to left. Yes. The fifth place is 10,000. So, we should write 3 in 10,000 place. Now, we will put comma. Comma we will put after each period. This means that the first comma is put after the hundreds digit. In the hundreds place we have 8. So we will put comma after 8. Now read this number 32,894. Like this only we will solve second one. First read the digits 1, 8, 4, 1, 5. Now we will write these digits in place value table. First we will go from right to left. From the right first digit is 5. So we will write 5 in units place. Now the second number is 1. Which is the second place in place value table from right side. Yes, tens place. So we should write 1 in tens place. Which is the third number? Yes, 4 is in the third number. Third place is hundreds. So we should write 4 in hundreds place. Now the fourth number is 8. Which is the fourth place in place value table? Yes, the fourth place is thousands place. So we should write 8 in thousands place. Next the fifth number is 1. Which is the fifth place in place value table? From right to left, yes, the fifth place is 10,000. So, we should write 1 in 10,000 place. Now, we will put comma. Comma we will put after each period. This means that the first comma is put after the hundreds digit. In the hundreds place, we have 4. So, we will put comma after 4. Now, we will write it in words. 18,415 Now we will go to second main. Write the following numbers in figures using commas. First we will read the words 45,618 Now we will go period wise. Here we have given 45,000. 45,000 will come in thousands period. 4 in 10,000 place. 5 in thousands place. Next we have 618. 618 will come in units period. 6 in 100 place. 1 in tens place. 8 in units place. We should put comma after each period. This means that the first comma is put after the hundreds digit. In the hundreds place we have 6. So we will put comma after 6. Like this only we will solve second one. First we will read the words 94,314. Now we will go period wise. Here we have given 94,000. 94,000 will come in thousands period. 9 in 10,000 place. 4 in thousands place. Next we have 300. 300 will come in units period. 3 in hundreds place. Next we have 14. 14 will come in units period. 1 in tens place. 4 in units place. Now we should put comma after each period. This means that the first comma is put after the hundreds digit. 
in the hundreds place we have three so we will put comma after three do this homework children first month write the place value chart for the given numbers second man write the following numbers in words third man write in figures fourth man answer the following